Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with another Rip Party break. Tonight is the Rip Party, the Top Series 1 Rip Party. A lot of fun. 2022 Top Series 1 Baseball coming at you. Six box, jumbo, random box break number three. Big thanks to this group for getting in on it. Appreciate it. And there are uh, the numbers right there. Oh, well, I, this is the dice roll we're going to use. Two. But I gotta open up the case first and number those boxes first. Got to number the boxes first. A nice easy dice roll, snake eyes afterwards. Jameson sponsor. So you can kind of see my chicken scratch right there, four, five, six up there, one, two, three over there. So now we'll use the snake eyes for the names and boxes. One and two. Dennis down to Dennis. And we'll go in box order as well. Snake eyes for the box numbers. One and two. We got three, six, two, four, five, one. Three down to one. Oh, I think Dennis has three. Yeah. All right, Dennis with three, four, and one. And since you have box one, we're going to do all three of your boxes first. Tim, you have six. Justin with two. And Jorge with five. So we'll do these uh, in numerical order. But since Justin or since Dus uh, Dennis is first. We're going to do his three boxes first. So we're going to print out the list for this. You have box one, three, and four. Then after that, we'll do Justin with box two. Then after Justin, we'll be Jorge with box five. Can you connect an actual good part of that? What? Can you connect an actual good part no. of that? No. Uh, maybe. No, I don't think so, actually. That's cool. There are there are amps that are that size that you can connect a real guitar really? to. Yeah, it's like a three watt amp, and it's. Oh. I'll bring it in one day. Uh, and last but not least, Tim. The box six. We're gonna, we're gonna, you're gonna be last, but definitely not least. All right. So Dennis, the box one. Uh, three. And four. And then here's box two, five, and six. Jason will show you on the top camera right there as he's ripping the boxes, just so you know that the correct boxes are being ripped. And these are Dennis's three and four right here. And I'll rip the first box here for Dennis. All right, Dennis, good luck. There's your box topper, Christian Pache. We'll do your silver packs at the end of your set of boxes. Oh, and at the end of this break, I'm gonna randomize everybody's uh, names. Name on top and the second name. Top two names will get a pack each. Am I tired yet of opening the same box? No, not not yet. Jason's actually been opening most of these packs, so I've been I've been I've been pretty good. I think we're gonna switch after ra uh, random box four. I think we might switch, and Jason will then do the next half. 
of the day. And then I'll be ripping the packs. These are uh, jumbo boxes. And once again, this is random break number th random box break number three. If you're just joining us, schedule in the chat if you're looking to see when your break is happening. Um, thankfully, we've been we've been doing jumbo boxes, so but that makes it a lot easier. For, that's for sure. I forgot to do this in break number one, ladies and gentlemen, but break two and this break here, for each each person's set of boxes, I'll do a quick, like, sort of numbered card hit recap at the end of uh, the person's boxes, whether it's one or three. That way you can kind of skip to that part when you're fast forwarding through the video and whatnot. All right. Uh, Dennis, thank you. For grabbing a few boxes and good luck. May the Wander Broncos be plentiful. We have not seen... Well, we've seen Wander Franco pretty much at least one. And I, this is not a guaranteed sort of situation. There may be none, but at least one per box. We've seen at least one per box of just a base Wander Franco rookie card. Now, what we have not seen, and we've maybe seen some inserts of him too, what we have not seen is any sort of numbered card for uh, for Wander Franco. So that's, I'm sure those are pretty few and far between, but if we found like a, a black border to 71 or something like that, maybe even a train whistle type number, that would be awesome. And obviously all cards ship. Yeah, I'm going to just put it aside right over here. Yeah. And also, ladies and gentlemen, if you're just joining us, or if you're wondering, um, we're all sold out. Group break-wise, we're all sold out. But if you want to do uh, get a box for yourself, a personal box, Instagram Live is on right now with uh, Jesse is on so you can buy a, a personal box with him or, or two or more <laughs> or all of them I think there's a limited supply so I would I would definitely get in early and often who knows Jimmy I don't know when baseball is going to start we were talking about this a little bit earlier. I think the here's a Riley Adams, eleven oh six out of twenty twenty two. I think the next two weeks, basically to the end of February, is very crucial. And you can see Jason showing the numbers two. and the box numbers right there. But the next two weeks are very crucial if we want to get opening day on time. If they get the deal done by the end of the month, then we're probably really missing pitchers and catchers reporting and maybe a week or two of regular spring training, but they'll still be able to get a spring training in and then get started on the regular opening day. There's Pete Alonzo. And anything after that, Anything after that, then you start you start running the risk of shortening spring training even more, which may not be ideal for, for starting pitchers especially, and maybe start pushing into the regular season. But but yeah, p uh, pitchers and catchers are supposed to report today. Wow, Jesse sold out already. Fernando saying, all right, well, thank you, everybody. 
try out more tomorrow on Instagram. Just limited today. There's Tim Raines. Yeah, we might have more, so keep an eye out tomorrow. Tim Raines is your autograph in this first box, Dennis. 005 out of 199. And there's our first Wander Franco. Williams die cut. Five. And nice Jared Kalanick, Seattle Pride. City flag patch card. I'm not sure exactly if that's the exact seal for the Seattle the city of Seattle, but looks really cool. There you go, Dennis. Sunny Gray on the back. Silver packs for Dennis. All right, so nothing too crazy there, but still nice. All right, so these two are. Then this is other boxes. One of these were box three, and one of these were box four. Silver packs, silver packs, your oversized cards, Jared Kalanick and Cabrian Hayes. All right, let's push on. Good, work. Good luck, Dennis. Thank you. And your first relic coming up is Carlos Correa. Piece of his lumber. Yeah, I think I was just going to say, he's still out there. Like deal, Dodgers at one point. deal, I mean, yeah. People are talking Dodgers, people are talking, I don't know if the Dodgers actually do that, but yeah. they were thinking maybe he goes to Detroit, but they just spent a bunch of money on Javi Baez to be out there. They're thinking maybe, I mean, maybe he goes to... The Yankees, the Yankees might want to stay. There's a good, there's a possibility he just stays, yeah. And we got an out of 71, Zach Eflin. Nice black border here. These are really sharp. That's Vlad Guerrero die cut. And there's our, another Wander Franco rookie card.
Has anyone noticed? I feel like this happens every. Has anyone noticed patterns yet? Like in all these cards, like if you see a, you know, if you see a Christian Yelich, then you're gonna see a Wander Franco. Has anyone seen that yet? Maybe it's maybe too too small of a sample size for those eagle eyes. Another Wander Franco. And then Christian Yelich. <laughs> Christian Yelich comes before or after. Matt Olson short print. Nice. Just kicking it. Kicking it in the locker room. I think my this just yeah, this is the card number is six zero at the end, so the standard short print. We haven't seen a we have not seen a super short print yet, which has a different number, and I think that is just limited to just three or four players, maybe. Oh yeah? Ask him on the IG stream what the pattern is. And relay it back to us. There's a Wander Franco 1987. A pretty cool design. These are really cool. I think they're just manufactured, but it still just looks awesome. <laughs> Commemorative MLB silhouetted batter logo medallion. Cabrian Hayes. And we got a Seth Beer autograph. Mmm, beer. Mm -hmm. Diamondbacks edition. It used to be a Astro, I think. I'm not sure what that trade was, but there it is. And there's Yaz, die cut. All 
right, and the third and final box here for Dennis. Good luck, Dennis. So far, so good, I want to say. We'll do a quick recap of your three boxes at the end of your run. There is Major League Material, Jose Abreu, piece of his jersey. Brandon, what's up? Been a, been a while. I'm doing well. How are you? Did a personal the other day with Chris. Pop his carry update jumbo. It was loaded. What'd you get? What were some of the highlights? And thanks for... Uh, Thanks for putting Chris to work. Got a Ty France, 445 out of 499 green. And a Johnny Bench die cut. The, the white mat here that they made kind of over, over color corrects the brightness so it makes the cards look kind of dark. So the women aren't playing tonight? No, I guess not. At least not the U.S. Oh, there it's tomorrow, I think. Maybe it's Wednesday then? My days are all mixed up. And your autograph in this box is Zach Thompson. Zach Thompson for the Marlins. The Clippers had actually caught up, it looks like. But it looks they really? like somebody turned it over and they hit a three. And now mm -hmm. they're about like seven. That was Chris Paul. got a Cal Raleigh short print. Nice. All right, second half for you, Dennis, of this box. Two autos, Andrew Vaughn. Cronenworth, bunch of numbered rookies. That's not bad. Franco. I feel like we're just getting closer to. Oh, and there's Christian. There was Christian Yelich right there. Hmm. There might oh, be a like pattern. A yeah. yeah, Christian Yelich might be. Christian Yelich base card might reveal a Wander Franco base card. They usually do do like that. Or Ichiro in, in series update was like behind. He's trying to find out Juan Soto's rookie.
and a Kettle Marte. Phoenix Pride. I'm not sure if that's actually the flag of flag for Phoenix. But it's a city flag patch card. It's a manufactured patch. They were, it's really cool, though. Any huge autos yet? We've been getting some solid autos. Johnny, we could pull the Johnny Bench auto. Dwight Good an autograph. But we have not seen anything... In t well, the huge auto would be Wander Franco. We have not seen... An auto like that. But a lot of great parallels, though. And we did pull a, I, think, I want to say we did pull a Josiah Gray autograph, which, hey, if he ends up having a strong season, that could be huge by the end of the year, too. And there's a Wander Franco 2021's Greatest Hits insert for Dennis. Now, there are auto potentials in these silver packs. So, good luck, Dennis. Or numbered cards. All of these have the, those gold borders, but they're not numbered. There it is. Purple. Jose Ramirez to 75. 31 out of 75. And that's for the Cleveland Guardians now. You think they photoshopped that? Or do you think there was a game they played? No, nah, they'd have to photoshop that. If they what? had a photo of it. Unless they had them go on a blue on the green screen or something like that. And then they just like... Oh, right, right, right. They, oh, yeah, but it might be photoshopped. Huh. They did not have those last year. Like not even for like the last game of the season I don't did like think a. So. That's kind of weird. Oh wow! Tim says that Phoenix Pass is from the city government. You definitely know the city council. There you go. All right. There it is. So quick little recap for Dennis. Thank you, Dennis, for getting in. I appreciate it. That was really cool. That medallion. So a nice few boxes for you. Thank you. All right. So now we're going numerical order. So next is Justin with box two. Then Jorge with box five. And then last but not least, city government official Tim Swartz. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, some fighting here? Some fighting? Don't hurt Connor. <laughs> All right, Justin, thank you for getting in box two for you. We'll do those silver packs last. Good luck. So I'm saying it's strange it would only be the city of Phoenix, not the state, since the Dimebacks are Arizona Dimebacks and not Phoenix, for funding tax proposals for the stadium. Yeah, I mean, well, they call them city flag patches specifically. So they're specifically targeting the city. But yeah, maybe, maybe I don't know, if there's some tax ramifications, maybe Starling Marte for you, Justin. The uh, tops inadvertently cause some drama. 43 out of 50. Is this Fanatics' first product too? They're not supposed to have one until end of this year. Oh, okay, okay. 
I guess this would be the last uh, new uh, 2022 should be the last year of just tops on its own. Of just tops on its own, but they're still owned by Fanatics as we speak. Yeah. Gotcha. Because I think in the future, like 2023 yeah, Series yeah, 1 have, might be like Fnatic a Fanatics brand. company or a Fanatics logo or something like that. There's some kind of Fanatics branding. I think they're going to keep all the tops branding too, but might be an extra logo or two there. Reggie Jackson die cut. There's another one. Philadelphia Pride. Bryce Harper. Yeah, they call the City Flag Patch Card. I think it was a cool idea. There's another Wander Franco. Did we see a Yelich back there? I wasn't, actually wasn't really paying attention. Yeah, there's a Christian Yelich. So after a Christian Yelich, should be a Wander Franco. At least, at least that's the pattern I'm noticing right now. Maybe there could be a different pattern in different cases, but for these jumbo cases anyway, I've really only been paying attention to the last couple of boxes. All right, Justin, there you go. Wander Franco for you. So maybe you see a Christian Yelich. Chances are you're going to see a Wander Franco rookie card right behind him. All right, Justin, second half of your box. Oakland A's, 38 out of 299 team card. Sam, what's up? How are you? There's Jacob Stallings. Joe P's wondering, do we like this year's design? Joe, Joe P's kind of up in the air. How does everyone else feel? I don't think it's anything too revolutionary, but I think it's nice. I like kind of like the gradient right here. I like the names are names are nice and big this year too. I think it's just solid. It's just nice and clean. It's Javier Baez for the Mets. Mets edition for Justin. Sam likes it better than last year's.
That's how we know the Suns wins when Joe, when they lose, Joe P doesn't show up. They beat the Clippers. Although Clippers did beat the uh, Warriors last time, I think. Ooh, that's a Wander Franco. Nice. I think that's, uh, is that the first Wander Franco we've seen in a silver pack? Yeah, they did, didn't they? Might be the first uh, silver pack Wander Franco that we've seen today. Looks nice. All right, Justin. Thank you. All right, Jorge, you're next. Pack or pack five? Box five. There you go. Good luck. All right, your future stars. Oversized card, Bobby Dalbeck. They're pretty nice. We'll do your silver packs later. Here's, here's the box. Good luck. Nice. Yeah, treasure those parlay wins. Those are always nice. There's Jacob DeGrom die cut. City flag patches have been really cool. Vlad Guerrero Jr. A piece of the maple leaf right in there too. One thirty six out of two ninety nine. Soto flipped around. Ooh, home field advantage. I think these might fall one one per case or one every other case. This is break three. I don't think we saw one in one of the cases. It's a nice one, Jorge. As of now, Joe P, we're, as of now, at least our position is is uh, we're just uh, we're just leaving and top loading Wander Franco. It could be another player that emerges later on this year, but as of now, that's that is the case. Also, here's the pattern we were talking about. Oh, this is the first time we're seeing Cleveland Guardians right here as well. Here's the pattern we were talking about. We see Corbin Burns, Wander Franco, and then Christian Yelich. That seems to be the pattern. You see, I guess Corbin Burns comes first. So it's Burns, Franco, Yelich. So 
So when you see Corbin Burns, Franco should be in, in between Burns and Yelich. At least that's what we've seen in this particular case. <laughs> I think that's exactly what they're what they're going for, Sam. And here's your autograph. Taylor Meagle. Or McGill? We Taylor McGill. GTM saying that's the same pattern on Instagram as well. That's what you, they've been seeing. So yeah, maybe that's, that's the pattern, at least in these jumbo cases. Yeah, I'm pretty sure... Uh, I'm pretty sure Kalanick, Jared Kalanick was last year. Oh, and there's Jose Abreu right here. What's the biggest auto pulled so far? I'm not sure. We have not. We haven't pulled like a Wander Franco auto or anything like that. And there's Alex Wells. One thirty one out of three hundred. There's the once again there's the Burns Franco Yelich pattern. That's a nice return, Rex. Is that what we were kind of thinking of when we when we pulled that? Clayton Kershaw die cut. And Alex Wells again to twenty twenty two. Seven out of 2022. A few other cards here, obviously all card shit. All right, let's see what your silver pack cards are gonna be. There, we, yeah, we were saying 150 to 150 to 200. All right, so there you go, Jorge. Thank you. All right, one more box to go in this case, and we'll unveil another one. So, got another home field advantage, Juan Soto. Oh, shit. I feel like maybe it's every other case three, because yeah. we only two out of three. But something to look out for in those later jumbo breaks. Jorge, thank you. All right. Last box of this case. Last but definitely not least, Tim. With box six. Thanks, Tim, for getting in. Your oversized card is Akil Badu. Could be a future star here. And then there are two silver packs, which we'll do at the end. 
All right, final box of random box number three, ladies and gentlemen. Random box number four coming up in the next video. Satchel Page die cut. got Charlie Blackman, Denver Pride, City Flag Patch. Nice. Those City Flag Patches have been one of my little favorite bits of Series 1 so far. Got Jorge Mateo, seven, uh, 75 out of And your autograph is Zach Pop. It's your autograph. Let's see what else we got out of here. Oh, there's Corbin Burns, Juan Franco, Christian Yelich. Wandering, no, oh, I'm a wandering. And we got major league material, a piece of Xander Bogart's at bat. Cedric Mullins, 209 out of 2022. I like that look. What is he saying? It's three. Three strikes. You're out.
All right, almost to the end, Tim. Let's try to finish strong here. Cal Ripken Jr. die cut. And we've got one more numbered card for you. That's Andrew Miller. You Darvish, Ricky Henderson, Anthony Rizzo, plus your silver packs. Twelve eighty-eight out of twenty twenty-two. No, Rex. Basketball's had had uh, labor disagreements. Hockey had a couple that nearly killed their sport. NFL, has the NFL had one in recent memory? I don't know if the NFL must not have had one in recent memory. Maybe in the 80s. All right, we've got some, got some color coming up here. We've got Matt Manning, purple, 75 out of, 47 out of 75. Meadows... Castro, Yount, and Frank Thomas. All right, there you go, Tim. There you go, everybody. Thanks to thanks to everybody who got a box in this. Oh, maybe even more recent than I thought. 2017, 18. All right. Um, and we're giving away. So Tim, thank you. Oh, let's do a quick recap for you, Tim. Thank you. Now let's see uh, who's going to win those extra packs. All right, so we're giving away these two packs here. So let's uh, flip back to the list. You're welcome, Tim. I wish there was more like Wander Francos, but I appreciate you making this happen. Let's gather everybody's names. Let's copy them. New dice, new list. Let's roll it, randomize it three times. Top two after three, get those extra um, event exclusive packs. One, two, and three. Good luck. Good. After three, Tim and Dennis. Congrats to the both of you. You will be getting these uh, Rip Party packs. Thanks for joining the Rip Party. Thanks, everybody. And thanks to Tim again and Dennis again for joining in. Get a little extra exclusive pack, event exclusive pack. Um, thanks, everyone, for watching. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.